Hi, and welcome to my playhouse. And uh, today, I'm in the basement playing around with uh, with some um, fan blowers for from computers. And this is from an Intel something. It really doesn't matter, but it it has a big fan. And I was playing around with the thought of mounting this on my radiator, the big one in the living room, just. Just for giggles, um, they are they are very big those radiators and they are they're doing quite good. But I was thinking if if I was able to blow up some blow down some air or blow up some air, I could improve the performance of the radiator. And therefore, I found these uh, fan ventilators and I tried to to put on some power on them. And we'll just. I'll just show you what happens. <clears throat> Here I got my little workspace, and I got a I got a power supply, and I have been putting on power to this, and I found out that 12 volts they make a lot of noise, but if I reduce the power a bit. They are almost silent. Let's see if we can do this. This is 10 volts. Okay, now it's it's making the table vibrate. So 20. This is around 12 volts. That's a bit too noisy, so I was thinking about about oh, wobbly wobbly uh, around nine to ten volts, and I already I went ahead and I I got another one, this one, which I I tested it out with the heat sink on it and found out that when the heat sink is on it, it blows out air in, in kind of all directions and I wanted it to go straight down or straight up, so I think I'm, I'm not gonna need the heat sink, really. And I found a power supply, <clears throat> this is like 9 volts, oh. let's see if we can see that. Oh, there we are. It's DC and it's 9 volts, 300 milliamps. Um, it has been used for something else, but um, now I'm gonna use it for this project. And I've just I made a very quick connection here. Um, it's only 9 volts, so nothing can really happen. So I, I just pulled the wires together and and I plug this in and it turns around and Ooh. and I have a little fan and this I think I can mount on my radiator I have a couple of wires here and that's for the there's a, there's a device in, it's, a, it's a sensor in the in the fan that measures the temperature and gives the information to the computer so that it can be shown to the user. And I'm not gonna use those. I'm not entirely sure if I'm gonna cut them off. Actually, I think I'll cut them off. I'll just turn this off. sensor I think or maybe actually it might be the the thing that tells the computer how fast this fan is moving there's like turns per minute 
in a computer. Just cut that off there. That might be their job. And uh, yeah, let's let's go and mount it on the reg uh, radiator and see this. Okay, here is the radiator, and actually, this is bad timing because the thermostats they just turned down the temperature to eight degrees because it's Sunday and I'm supposed to go home, but I'm still playing. I don't want to go home now. So, but the, my f first thought was that the blower could sit up here and blow down here. Um, but I think that's really, it's, it's blowing the air in the wrong direction. Um, so all the, all the air heated by the radiator, it wants to travel up. Hot air rises. And if I put it up here, it's gonna try to blow down the hot air in the opposite direction that it really wants to go. So I, I am probably gonna try to mount it down here. And if we're lucky, it can just, can just plug in. It might. It, it kind of plugs in here. Let's we'll see if we can go down there. right in and I got a plug right over here and it turns so now I have an air cool radiator I'll just unplug the camera and Kind of lucky there was like a, a plug right beside. Can we see it down there? Might be able to see it down through the radiator. Yeah. It's down there turning. And I can feel the hot air coming up here. So, big success. So that's a really alternative use of a fan blower from a computer. So I've, I've always proclaimed that Intel processors are the best. So this is why <laughs> no, they are good. So I, I'm happy with this. I'm not gonna leave it on there. This is just for fun and giggles. So. I might, I might do something else with this thought later on. This this could be fun to play along with. Maybe find some blowers that's totally invisi invincible, that you can't see them when they're on the radiator, um, and they they will increase the efficiency of the radiator by a lot. They will. It's it's like having having a cooler on a computer CPU it reduces the heat of the CPU by a lot so the same thing goes uh, with a radiator when you blow up the uh, well, blow up is a bad word but when you blow cold air along the surface of it it will cool down a lot faster than if it has to um, 
generate its own airflow. So, I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, subscribe to my channel and you'll see me again. Bye bye.